Laredo Kid. I know for a fact everybody in TNA Wrestling is thinking about Chris Bay and his road to recovery, but especially Trey Miguel and Zachary Wentz very, very close with Chris Bay. The battles between the Rascals and the ABC bonded them as brothers. I know they are thinking about Chris every time they step out there, as are all of us here in TNA. If you would like to find a way that you can contribute and help out Chris Bay in his road to recovery, his rehabilitation process. We invite you to head to TNAWrestling.com right now for more information. I hope everybody else, I hope oh, you. Cover, oh. cover, kick out by Slater. I hope Chris and everybody's got the close eyes on this matchup. Make sure you do not blink. These guys are some of the quickest, most agile in the entire game today. Slater, look at the pace. Oh, <laughs> This is one of those popcorn matches. You just sit back and enjoy yourself and be dazzled by the athleticism. I haven't seen an athletic dive roll like that since I was in the ring. So, man, hats off to Leon Slater. Majestic almost. Usually when you dove, you're being thrown. That's it, it why. It was still majestic, <laughs> despite the outcome. You did have a nice scent on once upon a time. And now Wentz, look at this. Speaking of majestic and athletic. Tag. Toe-to-toe, -to -toe, these guys are going in. Come Florido Kid. Tag made by Trey Miguel. Miguel, a two-time X Division champion, twice a TNA World Tag Team champion. Whoa! Been an emotional year for the Rascals. The betrayal of Wesley from NXT weighs heavy on their hearts, but they've moved forward here in TNA. Oh! Like looking in a mirror. Slater, El Laredo Kid. Up against the Rascals, this match is just getting started here on Impact. Picture in picture. And some of the best that the X Division has to offer all here in tag team action. Very like minds in this matchup, as we've seen so far. Oh, Miguel tracked down by Laredo Kid. Slater to meet Wentz. I still can't get over the performance from Wentz earlier on this year. And then Stall, Mike Bailey put on an instant classic at Victory Road for the X Division Championship. Bailey winning that matchup, but still, that was incredible. Further proof of why we have some of the best athletes in all of professional wrestling competing here in TNA. Whether it be for the TNA world title, tag team titles, or of course the prestigious X oh. Division title. There was some unique offense by Zachary Wentz. Left arm driven into the steel post and the Miguel followed it up. That is excellent tag team wrestling by the Rascals. They found an opportunity and they took advantage of it. Using the entirety of the ring. Fighting into a cover and a kick out at one by the young Leon Slater. And now isolating him from his tag team partner, Laredo Kid. Again, everybody in this matchup tag. experienced X Division wrestlers, but the Rascals had the advantage of having that brother-like rapport, that chemistry as a tag team. Oh. Slater, a damaged left arm being pulled out there by Miguel. Slater's trying to fight Trey Miguel here every step of the way. He's damnedest. Miguel now tying Slater up. Now tying up the right arm. Left arm was damaged one. Having a little fun there at the expense of Laredo Kid. Look at this. Ooh, a little small joint manipulation. I heard it. I heard it. Cover, cover, and a kick out. Oh, that was a nasty crack. It's like a bug zapper. A tag made. Uh, the referee is not going to allow that one. You can't tag somebody's foot. Well, I just can. Daniel Spencer's allowing it. You can't tag somebody's foot. Wow. All right. Referee's discretion here yep. as this match continues. There's a cover and a kick out. It's first. Wentz into control here. Keeping Leon Slater grounded, and that's a smart strategy if you're the Rascals. Leon Slater 
Bryant trying his damnedest to get back into this matchup. Wentz tying up both arms of Leon Slater in this X Division style tag team matchup on Impact. And we are back here on TNA Impact. The Rascals are in control in this tag team matchup against the team of Leon Slater and Laredo Kid in the ring right now is Zachary Wentz and Leon Slater. We are so excited for final resolution tomorrow night live on TNA Plus in Atlanta, Georgia. Our final live broadcast of 2024. You do not want to miss out. The Rascals continuing their assault and the left arm of Leon Slater has kept him grounded throughout much of this matchup. And that assault continues courtesy of Zachary Wentz. And Slater trying to get his long legs out to the bottom rope to try and break up this submission, and he does. And Wentz able to relinquish still to come later on tonight. We'll see the TNA World Champion Nick Nemeth, the Knockouts World Champion, Robert Slamovich. Slamovich. Kick out there, plus Joe Hendry teaming up against Tasha Steeles in first class that is still to come tonight. Also, PCO and Sammy Callahan will face Jake Something and Hammerstone, and also the rivalry between Spitfire and Elegance continues. Heather by Elegance faces one half of the Knockouts World Tag Champs, Danny Luna tonight on Impact. Ooh, ooh. Leon Slater here in this matchup doing his best to evade the Rascals. Oh! Finally, cutter, a cutter there by Slater. Trying to fight off the pain in that left arm. This is a huge opening, though, for Leon Slater. Slater able to make the tag with his one good arm, and Alvarado Kid in against Wentz. Alvarado Kid's been desperate to get into this one. Quickly turning Wentz inside out. Oh, big forearm blast by Laredo Kid, our TNA Digital Media Champion. Look at that. There's one. You know Laredo Kid, he wants Uno Mas or more. Right to the midsection, here's the cover, and Wentz able to power out in time. Just at the last second. Moreno Kid, though, ready to keep cooking here. A tag made, Leon Slater is legal into the matchup, but that left arm is in trouble. Yeah, still feeling the effects from much of this matchup, courtesy of the Rascals. Tag made. Trey Miguel is legal. Oh! Double Hurricane Rock! Little stereo action from the boys, and now they're not done yet! And the Rascals through their own dropping Kid and Slater. And this reinvigorated Rascals are starting to dominate once again. A whole new light in their eyes, along with something else as the boys are taking over, but look out! Oh, and Laredo Kid with the dive, wipes out Trey Miguel, and now Slater over the top! You gotta take a look back, the Rascals thought they had it all figured out here, beautiful stereo dive, but then things took a turn courtesy of Laredo Kid and Leon oh. Slater. And a kick right to the face, Laredo Kid follows up. Two on one opportunity. Trey McGill's in a bad spot here. And they shut down the rest. Momentum! Cover by Slater! Oh, and a kick out. That damaged left arm. It prevented Slater from getting a proper cover until the last moment. It allowed McGill to kick out. Can't apply quite as much pressure as you normally would with a good arm. That was all Trey Miguel needed. And now you even see trying to raise Miguel back up with just one arm. Is Leon Slater, Miguel fighting him. Changing strategy, just 20 years of age, but he's learned from some of the greats throughout his career. He's been very open on social media. Our TNA legend, Rockstar Spud, has helped him improve his game here. His time spent in the United States. Tag made, in comes Laredo Kid. Oh! Tag! That was a bad side of the ring to get out on. Yep. Laredo Kid, look out. 
And now Lance with a senton. Great double team offense. Cover. Oh, and Slater breaks it up, keeping the match alive. Slater beaten and bruised in that left arm, absolutely battered, but still in this fight. Outstanding tag team matchup here tonight on TNA Impact on the eve of final resolution. We know the Rascals are dead set on getting back in the TNA World Tag Team title picture. Now all four men going toe to toe back and forth. Battle of wills here. Alredo Kidd and Leon Slater getting the better of this exchange, but Wentz goes to the injured left arm of Slater. Very smart. Oh, there's a knee by Wentz. Leg Larry by Slater. Everybody's starting to go down, but Slater standing tall. And now Slater rolling out. What are Slater and Laredo Kidd thinking here? Tag made, Slater's legal. And look where Wentz is. Oh, could it be time? Perfectly placed for Slater. He's got to climb with one arm here. Looked like he was maybe trying to pop that shoulder back into place. Wentz is down. Could be thinking, Swanton 450. Is it time to put it away? Now the Rascals, combination offense here. Yeah. On oh, a double stop. Soup kitchen, cover. The Rascals put away Ken and Slater. Here are your winners, the Rascals. This was a huge opportunity tonight for all four of these men. Take nothing away from Leon Slater and Laredo Kid. But the Rascals walked away with an impressive win. Let's take another look at how the Rascals were able in the closing moments to turn this one around with some combination offense right into the double team. Lanty Laredo Kid and the 1-2-3 go to the boys from the treehouse. I'll ask you as a former tag team champion, do you think the Rascals are prepared to dive back into the tag team title picture? The Rascals over the last several weeks have proved why they are one of the best tag teams in TNA, and another win puts them in the hunt for the title once again. On the brink of a sold out final resolution, plenty of implications for that event still to come in our main event. Also, the battle between Spitfire and Elegance continues tonight on Impact. But coming up next, what is going on with this 23 business? PCO and Sammy Callahan face Jake something in Hammerstone next.